Hello everybody and welcome back to Gotham Lounge. My name is Joe and today we're back with some more Lego Jurassic World for charity. So just a friendly reminder, the two charities I'm representing this game before. The first one is called Extra Life for Kids and the other one is called Pure Jam for Liam. So as always, I will leave links to both charities in the description of this video down below. So feel free to check out both charities and together we can make the world a better place. Alright, we continue to be in the Lost World portion of LEGO Jurassic World. Let's see, where are we off to next? Take it down a whole tree. Follow this path down this direction. So I'm controlling Ian at the moment. Ian Malcolm. And we got so many uh, objects here to take down and collect studs for. I'm not going to take down all because otherwise we'll that's gonna be a whole separate video in itself, and yeah. In the free play world, it doesn't seem to matter too much at the at the moment. But uh, when I'm playing the actual level levels, and I get the true survivor, that is usually what's mattering most. So let's see. Oh, hang on. I need. I need you to do something for me, sir. Alright, so that just broke down. Oh, I fell straight down. Alright, what are we building? Oh, just plain and simple. All the way across the creek. Alright, let's see. As I'm still, like, on impulse, collecting all the studs. Whoa! Well, that's not where to go. However, I got this guy who could take down that branch. I kind of just noticed that last minute. Oh, uh, hold on. Here we go. That was bizarre. He, uh... What the? It's also bizarre. You didn't even grab it. Ah, uh, excuse me, sir. You jumped on the vine before I was ready, and I can't get up there now. Um, <laughs> I'm struggling. I'm really struggling. The camera's, like, not being cooperative to me at all. You know what I'm gonna do? Since he's already... Swing it across. There we go. Always the way around things. I lost a ton of studs because I kept falling. There we go. I'm just gonna try and make up for some of the lost studs. That was uh, quite a lot that just kind of dropped. All right, let's see, how do we get up? Oh, we got a big pile of poop. All right, Sarah, well. This must be your thing, girl, so I'm gonna have you go right ahead, jump right in that poop. A lot of studs. Well, decent little studs. But stuff to build, too. All right, we're gonna go boingy boingy on this thing. There we go. Here's another fascinating fact for you. Just like the Tyrannosaurus goes through a growth spurt, right about the age of 14, they pack on over 1,000 pounds a year until they reach adult size. And it's pretty wild. This is as good a place as any for base camp. This is a game trail, Mr. Ludlow. If you want me to run your little camping trip, I'm in charge. Okay. Okay! Dieter, get into the outrigger. You're closing in on her. The one with the big red horn, the pompadour. Hold that up in the back of the head. Wow. <laughs> it's like he planned on lying down. 
Simply put, Ingen is seeking up? limited partners tea? to defray some of our expansion I costs. Just flew across the sky. You don't bring people halfway around the world to visit a zoo. You bring the zoo to them. Mr. Hammond knew this before he ever dreamt of an island. He began construction on an amphitheater. San Diego is the perfect site. It could be completed and ready to receive visitors in less than a month. We're taking these animals out of here. They're back to the mainland. Uh, I think I should tell you guys. Hammond told me these people might show up. He did send a backup plan. What backup plan? Me? Camp sabotage. Okay. Checkpoint. I mean, technically, we just stopped the level, losing? so How yeah. How much sedative did you shoot it? I, I thought it was a stegosaurus. My depth perception is terrible. <laughs> All right, let's see. Got little meese uh. running around. Tons of meese running around. <laughs> All right, keep the studs coming. Cause now we're officially in the level. Uh, I think that's all we got for the moment. Uh. Who are you? They can't be here. Get them! Oh wait a minute. Uh. Uh. We gotta get my security. Hey! Wow, they really don't want us here. See something through the gate. Can you move the spotlight? Uh, can we move the spotlight? I don't know. We'll find a way. I'm not an idiot. I think I know how to move a spotlight. I mean, it's basically my only job. Look, ah. are you gonna move the spotlight or not? Well, I don't know. I mean, I guess if there's a reason to, I will. I'm sure someone will tell me if there is, though. Sheesh, what kind of stupid question is that? I'm not a fortune teller. Would I get in trouble if I shot him with a tranquilizer gun? Probably. Okay, uh, you said you're gonna move the spotlight. Are you gonna do me a solid, sir? Alright, let's see. Can't even get up there. Oh, never mind. Come on out, dinosaur. I don't know what you are. You're tired. All right, what are we supposed to do here? How are we supposed to fix the dinosaur? All right, well, in the meantime, get your hand on that poop. Oh, we gotta cure it. Hey, what's going on down there? Someone's left the Pachycephalosaurus out! How do you say a Pachycephalosaurus? <laughs> I sound like I'm... Saying the name of a cephalosporin drug. Oh, heads up. Get the guy that's shoveling and now suddenly attacking. Grab 
whatever I can. Alright. I know I gotta build that. finding. Oh! Ice cream in the poop. Let's give it to the dinosaur. That will make it feel better. There you go, dinosaur. Alright, I need to find a banana and a mushroom. Now, I can't... I really can't... Oh, I can get up here. Blue stud. I want to... And we'll take the mini kit. That's a win. Alright. And so far, as far as the true survivor status, we're a little close to halfway there. I see the mushroom in the pot right up there. It's just a matter of how to get it. Of course, it has something to do with building this. Um, let's see. Okay, there's a mushroom. Alright, that's coming with me. Go ahead and feed this to the dinosaur. I am not going to be able to repeat what it's called again for the life of me. I have no idea how to say it. I want to say it was like a Pachocephalosporus or something. I don't know my prehistoric animals. I need to get on that. I'm already a little bit more than a fifth of the way through the game. Um, don't have the right character for that, but I have the right character for this. I'm gonna get this thing wide open. Oh, there's our banana. Alright, let's go bring this back. And hopefully the dinosaur will be cured. Here you go, dinosaur. Oh, you're all better now. Oh, you're friendly, too. Pachocephalosaurus is what it's called. Alright, I'm... What I... I gotta figure out where to go with him. Yeah. Walking like a dinosaur mission. Oh, I can just really just trample over everybody here. Holy moly. Uh can you do anything? Oh I can shake my butt. No, I can't. Okay, well, that's a game changer. Nice. I think, honestly, I could probably, as I change characters, I, could, I was gonna say, I could probably, I might be okay with just uh, controlling that dinosaur the rest of the level, so long it permits. Oh yeah, we got something going on over there. Uh, but we got lots of other stuff going over here, too. I just need to see what we got. Ow! I think I can actually get over there. Uh, I might have to control the dinosaur. 
Wait, what is it? I don't have the right dinosaur for that. Okay. Uh, so I think my only option right now is I can't... There's a mini kit in there. And I'm gonna assume I don't have access. So my only other option... I... Let's try that again. There we go. Okay. I can jump, but not well. Uh, I'm assuming the dinosaur can't build anything. There we go. Uh oh, uh, we got more troubles company. brewing. Yeah, the dinosaur's free. Yep, go ahead, chase him. What the? There shouldn't be anyone else on the island. Capture them! Oh boy. We're not making friends over here on this island. Alright, let's keep the show rolling. Uh, we got a couple of Triceratopses in there. Breaking stuff open, collecting all these studs. Oh yeah, there's more of these guys. There's another dinosaur stuck in that cage too. That. I'm trying to see what it is. Yeah, it looks like a Stegosaurus. Oh, I can break that. Okay, I didn't think I could. I can't break those trees. Let me tell you about some of the attractions we have in store for the park. For a start, we'll have a packing set of Sorus Petty. Of course, those particular dinosaurs have a habit of headbutting anything with them. But the same is true of goats, and everyone seems okay with them. Alright, um, we're getting this area pretty well cleaned up as far as studs and everything else. Alright, so I did see in this area, we got a couple of trap dinosaurs. Oh, and obviously a major one right in front of me. This is a big one. That for sure is a Stegosaurus, I know that. Alright, we're almost at True Survivor. Very, very close, rather. Can't get back there. Oh, actually, can I get this plant over here? Alright, every little bit counts. Um... Oh, we still got more over here on this side. Tons more to break down. Another plan is to use Brachiosauruses as slides, thanks to their long necks. And as they're herbivores, they're extremely unlikely to eat any of the visitors. We think we'll lose one, perhaps two out of a thousand, which is well within our safety margins. A particularly profitable money spinner will be the Triceratops Ring Toss, a variant of the fairground mainstay with the added difficulty of like right competitors there. having to get the hoops over a moving target. I'd wager that one will bring in quite the pretty penny. Okay. Uh. Now, of course. It's a matter of what am I supposed to do first? Should I somehow free the Triceratops? I should be able to free the Stegosaurus. 
Yeah, let's get the Stegosaurus out. Alright, you're free! Come on! The Bigosaurus has escaped! Uh, the Bigosaurus! <laughs> learn their names, man! I'm trying to do the same thing. I, I can't learn these dinosaur names either. Alright. Alright. Oh. I can control the Stegosaurus. Oh, cool. Oh, what kind of abilities does this thing have? I can put out the fire. Uh. Oi. True survivor. I freed the baby Stegosaurus. Oh, yeah, we're causing a little bit of a ruckus now. Yeah, things are breaking open like crazy. And the Stegosaurus is now free. Alright, we'll take all those studs. Uh, what do I do here? Oh, I have a key! How? Oh, probably in the poop. All right, out you go, Triceratops. There we go. Oh, heads up. Any more I want to fight? All right, here we go, Triceratops. Ram through that. Should be able to ram through the other one. What am I building now? <laughs> building something else, too. One might say, you'd be up and running. Oh boy! He's got a broken leg, let's get in the car before they hear us. out of your mind? Slow Do you have any voice. idea what that is? Come on, open the door. You're nuts! Should make an interesting chapter in your book. Why is it all hey, you hey, hey, you hey, you hey, the man again. What do you need? We need three double cheeseburgers with everything. No onions on mine. I don't know, we'll turn it over. Am I climbing up? I just got a mini kit inadvertently. Yeah, I think we're supposed to climb. Ow! You can't even stay in the middle, like, you gotta be really good out of Oh, that's interesting. Alright, what, what do we do? What do we do? Here we go. 
Okay, we gotta hook the vehicle. your rate of climb. Oh, 
our communication equipment's been destroyed. Back We're off. stuck here, ladies and gentlemen, and stuck together thanks to you people. At least we came prepared. There's a communication center here, in the old operations building. If we can get here, we can send a radio call for the airlift. Oh. All right, I just got a trophy. Mommy's very angry. Yeah, that T-Rex was not having it with us. And we got the true survivor status. And I got two mini kits. AJ Sanu. Deirdre Bowman is unlocked. InGen Scout is unlocked. Gate of Ludlow Isla Sorna is unlocked. Kathy Bowman unlocked. Hunter Scout is unlocked. Hunter Snare ATV unlocked. And I did not get an amber bread. True Survivor and level complete, I got two gold bricks, and we shall continue the story. All right, we got quite a potty here. Oh, as that Lego studs right my way. Alrighty guys, well, another great week of Lego Jurassic World for charity, and another great week for making a difference in our community. So, until next week, guys, I'm going to actually go ahead and end the episode right here. So, thank you guys very much for tuning in today for this episode of LEGO Jurassic World here in Gotham Lounge. If you guys enjoyed the video, please go ahead and leave a thumbs up on the video, and feel free to leave a comment down below, as always. If you'd like to continue to stay in touch with us, watching future videos, or videos of our past, just go ahead and hit the subscribe button on the lower right hand corner of the screen and you'll get a bell notification every time I upload a brand new video. So once again guys, thank you very much for tuning in today for this episode of LEGO Jurassic World for charity here in Gotham Lounge. And you guys have a fantastic day.